Hi, I'm Paul Hanlon, backstage at the Jamba Show in Milan, uh, Hello Fashion TV. She's obviously come from a very wealthy background, but she was trying to be cool kind of a girl. So I think the casting's really important for this show because he's gone from a lot more diversity, the girl with fringes, bobs, a lot of texture in the hair. So the variety of the girls gives us the variety of the hair. So it's a very effortless, you know, just washed clean hair. So just working with each girl's uh, natural texture. And you. I really like it because it's very natural. There's not so much product and all of that is like my own hair. They just prepped it a bit and that's it. I drink all the time. Cause we're lovers. And that is a fact. Yes, we're lovers. Hi, my name is Val Garland. We are backstage at Giamba. It's Giamba glitterati girls that we're portraying here. It's the idea that she's very aloof. She's her own boss. She doesn't really wear makeup, but she likes the idea of makeup as symbolism. So she just paints these sort of like silver glitter symbols somewhere on her face, usually on her forehead. She's inspired by glitter rock, David Bowie. That's the look. Hi, I'm Lulu Laika and we are backstage at Jamba. I like that it's uh, very simple, but then like a touch of glitter. I, I like glitter, so that's good. Like dolphins, like dolphins can swim. I like the ear, it's kind of a bit glitter. <laughs> you can beat them forever and ever. Oh, we can be heroes. I'm Iris and we're backstage at Jamba. Just for one day. It's just fresh and natural and it doesn't take very long to make it like this, so I like it. Hello, I'm Ulrike and we are now backstage at Jamba. I love this simple natural look and there's no product or anything in my hair. I came like this and they haven't done anything, which I like. So of course, you are supposed to call me tonight. You are supposed to call me tonight. We would have gone to the cinema and after to the restaurant. Jamba is very sweet, very young, very provocative. You know, these are clothes for very young girls who have big wallets. You would have said I love you in the cutest place on earth where some little boys are dancing with the fairies. I would have waited like a week or two. The first look is like a white short dress and it's like with lace. Girl, if I find her, I swear, I swear I'll kill her, I'll kill her. She stole my future, she broke my dream, I'll kill her, I'll kill her. I'm wearing a dress just like a quite short dress. And um, yeah, then it has this pattern on it. Sometimes I'm funny. I would have met your dad, I would have met your mom. She would have said, please, can you make some beautiful babies? So we would have had a boy called Tom and a girl called Susan, born in Japan. So I'm wearing the black top and the black skirt, like super simple, super short. And it's super like kind of minimalistic, but at the same time it's super elegant, you know? That's what I like about Jean Baptiste, so it's a really love. I, I like the slippers I've got. Kilo, I'll kill her. She stole my future when she took you away. Jumbo was a real delight. What's just so great is that you get to see these um, pieces that you usually see in the haute couture and it's ready to wear, finally trickling down into something that you know young girls can wear on the street. And you can absolutely picture each of those pieces being worn on the street by young Milanese women who want to look playful and young and sweet and a little spicy at the same time. She'll dump your ass for a model called Brandon. 
He will pay for a beautiful surgery because he's full of money. I love because it's very cool, very feminine. I love the pink colors, the pink jackets, the bomber jackets, and the boots. My favorites are the boots. Everything is so shiny. I have like a very cool set with uh, trousers and uh, vest. Like a very cool girl set. Yeah, that's nice. I'm wearing a long white dress with some colors, uh, without sleeves. It's a nice dress. I'm wearing a long, really, really beautiful dress. It's really nice. It has uh, lots of great details in the fabric, and I'm excited to walk the show on that one. Jamba is fun and funky. It was beautiful. I mean, he does do it very well, and I think it's really a push for him to go into that realm of the younger girl who might be a little less sophisticated than the woman he, he normally designs for. And he did he did a good job. I would have met your friend, you would have had a drink or two, they would have liked me, girl.